Privyet, Turbiata, how are you? I hope you are having a good time anywhere in this world and welcome back to the Infinity Experience. It's Infinity talking to you from Kiev. Kiev is the city that I love the most in Ukraine. So today I'm going to share with you my story, how I met Fluffy. Fluffy, you want to say hello? Fluffy, say hello to the people. Oh look, he's very grumpy. But he's very cute. I named him Fluffy because he's so fluffy. Like, look at this. You can kiss him. You can hug him. It's like a, a pillow, really. Or a teddy bear. Moving teddy bear. Love it. Like, talking teddy bear. So, before I tell the story, guys, make sure to subscribe to my channel and uh, leave a comment. So I can update you with my lifestyle in Ukraine and give you all the information about how to travel safely to Ukraine and find a flat or you know you looking for specific things I can help you with all of that okay so the story of Fluffy so Fluffy this is how I found him two weeks ago I was walking in Kershatik Street and I went into the I want to cross the other side so I went downstairs and there's a tunnel inside. If you've been Kershatik, you understand what I'm talking about. And you will see like these people selling stuff, like everything, like, you know, food, groceries, um, you name it. And then I found this old babushka sitting in the corner with a box and two white kittens. The first one was Fluffy, he, and the second one, his sister. God knows what's her name now. Somebody took her birthday. So anyway, anyway, I hold both of them and when I hold Fluffy, Fluffy was very kind of happy. Now I'm not sure what's going, <laughs> going on with him. But Fluffy was very friendly. I loved his personality. And Fluffy is a Persian cat. So I told the Babushka, how much is this cat? She said 2,000 grivnas. I give her 2,000 grivnas. I, then I took Fluffy with me to this flat. And to be honest, this is one of the best decisions I made, you know, having a cat um, with you while you are traveling. I think it's quite uh, um, nice, um, you know, you have a company at home, it makes the atmosphere nice. And uh, Fluffy has a very interesting personality, he's not like a cat that likes to be alone. Fluffy likes, you know, to hug, like to, you know, um, like to touch, like to, it's like a baby, pretty much you are dealing with a baby. So this is uh, me living in Kiev with a cat at this moment. This is the new update. I live with Fluffy. I named him Fluffy because he is so fluffy. Like, and the best things about him, he's very smart. You know, uh, you don't need to much, uh, you know, do much work. I was thinking to have a dog in Kiev, but uh, first I thought it's uh, not a good idea because uh, it's out of work. So I thought I'm gonna start with a cat. So now I have a fluffy, but in the future, if I decided to settle in uh, Ukraine much longer, I might wanna get a dog as well. I already have a dog in Montenegro. Her name is Ria, she's half um, husky and half wolf but she is staying with my brother at this moment so that's all for today guys I wanted to share with you this news the fluffy news and me so fluffy and infinity will you know make YouTube videos about Kiev about Ukraine if you need any advice any tips any you know questions just leave a comment I can uh, help you with the many areas um, if you are looking for a consultation, you can contact me directly and I can, you know, guide you how to arrive to give safely, how to rent a flat or, um, you know, whatever actually you're looking for. I can show you the right way rather than, you know, going left and right and not knowing what you are doing there. So that's all for today, guys. And say, baka baka, baka baka. Look at the camera, Fluffy. Definitely he has a photogenetic look. Alright guys, until next time.